Hello, and welcome back to our Starfield Let's Play Poorly. All right, we, we've talked to this lady, and she doesn't want to talk to us right now. So we're going to have to find something else to do. What other activities we got? Boreal Us. Uh, check in on Kelton. Speak with Trevor. Are any of these... I don't know where these are. Uh... They are on Sidonia. Is that where I am right now? I don't know. No, I'm on Voli Alpha. At Neon. Okay, that's right. So, man, it would be really helpful if these told me where they were. Haven't I already done this? That particular thing? I guess I should see if I can do it again. Should I warm up the engines? No. Let's get up. Do I want to get up? I think that's what I do. Oh, cargo hold. There we go. That's all my stuff. I've already done this. Hmm. All right, well... That's fine. Unless they mean inventory like something in one of the boxes or something. Brownouts in the well. I'm pretty sure that's not here. Yeah, okay. Yumi, Constellation, Bartender at Viewport. That's also not anywhere here. Okay. Well, in that case, then let's go. Let's go do something else. Uh, something somewhere else. We got to up upload a program at Keltcorp. Oh, this is here. Oh yeah. Okay. We need to do this without getting caught. Yeah, yeah, I've been here before. I, I do really like this town. I think I've said that before. Alright, so I need to do a thing here. I wonder how the Crimson Fleet seems to be everywhere. It's because they have little outposts everywhere. To do to do to do to do to do to do to do. If you'll excuse me, I have a deadline to meet. Go for it. Go meet your deadline. Haven't I done this already? I'm working here. I feel like I did this. Oh, that's right. I failed, didn't I? I didn't have any digipix. Oh, right. Okay. Where do I get digipix? Witnesses, out of some deep cover. Yeah, this is uh This is very loosey goosey at the moment. Maybe we do that. Can I get there from here? Out of fuel range. So, oh yeah, I have to go here first. Can I not go there first?
There we go. Oh, right, I'm not in space, so it just jumps me there automatically. This is UC Security. Prepare to be scanned for contraband. Scan complete. You are cleared to land at New Atlantis. Please enjoy your visit to Jemison. Heck. Oh, right. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that's what it is. I've got to go to this other place. Uh, I don't want to jump there, do I? I guess I do. Yeah, all right. Okay, here we go. Oh, nice. All right. I, uh... Do I land here? What do I do? Oh, shit. Oh, no, that's just... That's the place. Okay, um... I supposed to land here. I need to not think of this as the way I play other games where you actually have geometry that you have to deal with because this I'm sure this is being this is going to be done by cutscene, right? Somehow. But I'm not sure how. I'm already there. Do I need to talk to somebody? Alright, so apparently I can just E. Alright, there we go. Target lock. Do I want to target? No, I want to hail. There we go. Port 1. Okay, let's go ahead and dock. Ah, oh, lovely. All right, let's uh, get up. I could board directly, but I wanna, I wanna try to do this a lot more smoothly than the game wants me to. Can I get out? How the heck do I get out? Um... Can I not leave? Oh, I guess maybe I have to get out for some other way? Uh... Alright, well, fine. We'll do it- we'll do it the way the game wants us to. Word and we'll get underway. Okay, we gotta speak to this guy. Welcome aboard the UC Vigilance. Did you have any questions before I escort you to the commander? Yes, could you please remind me what I'm doing here? Um... I, oh, right, I'm an official Vanguard business. Uh, well, yeah, is there anything should I, I should know? Yeah, listen to him carefully. The commander's a one-and-done kind of officer. In other words, he hates to repeat himself. Other than that, just observe standard military decorum, and it should keep you from serving any time on the ship's cleaning detail. Uh, okay, what can you tell me about the vigilance? I'm not authorized to divulge no. information about this vessel. Suffice to say, it's one of the toughest ships in the UC's arsenal. You're very smiley. All right. We have many of questions. Let's go. Follow me, please. Talk to the commander. So, 
You're the vanguard that took down that Terramorph on Tau City. I sure am, even though that happened by accident. Quite an impression around here. Everyone upstairs is talking about Oh it. my god, I Damn. hate these... Hmm. That must have been one hell of a firefight. I, I have to walk so fast. Missing out on all the fun. It was course, not fun. We don't normally see that kind of action on the vigilance, but we have our moments. All right, Vanguard. Take the lift up to Ops. Commander Akande should be waiting for you. Good luck. Thanks. Hello. Wow. Did somebody punch you in the face? What's with your nose? You're bloody. Howdy. Wow. All right. Oh, that smacked me in the head. Yes. Oh, this is gorgeous. I'm here for the vibes. That's. <laughs> oh, lovely. Our instrumentation is rated for long-term exposure to this level of cold. Stop complaining. It, wow, you're you got super super manly pose right there. Look at that. I'd like to brief you on the mission, so please pay attention. I will. Ah, there you are. Commander Kibwe Kande, UC Sistev. Glad to have you aboard. I was beginning to think you were having second thoughts about Commander Tuala's offer. Um well. I don't quite understand why I'm here. Yes, I know. I was intentionally vague when I advised Mast of my needs. But rest assured, I'll answer all your questions in due time. So, now that you're part of the team, allow me to introduce you to your new home. This is the operation center of the UC Vigilance. Sysdef's nerve center dedicated to the destruction of the Crimson Fleet. Uh what am I doing here? Whether this ship is impressive or not, you're the key element that we've been lacking. We need eyes and ears inside the Crimson Fleet. Someone who can feed us information, evidence, and expose their weaknesses. The catch is that you can't just knock on their front door and ask for an application. Getting inside is going to take some finesse. Hey! Uh, get me in a room with that. That doesn't make any sense. Uh, am I expendable? No, I'm just I'm going to trust you that you know what you're doing. I do. Our intelligence has managed to find a possible opening into the Crimson Fleet through Sersha Borden, one of their contacts. I'm impressed that they pronounced that she correctly. She works for the Trade Authority in Sidonia, so you'll be using a container of Aurora we've loaded on your ship to oh get dear. Your attention. Um, where did you get the contraband? I guess that's a good question. That's classified. Okay. Suffice to say that the smuggler who was previously holding it will be spending the rest of their life in prison. It doesn't sound ironclad because I'm going to get caught. Well, it's the best we've got. That ah, instills Once confidence. Once you your way into the Crimson Fleet, then the operation proceeds to evidence gathering. That's where my second-in-command, Lieutenant Gillian Topped, comes into the picture. She'll explain everything you need to know. Um... Okay, point the way. Eager to get going. Good. Remember, this entire operation rests on your ability to infiltrate the Crimson Fleet and bring us the evidence we need to take them down. Your man, I guess. Uh, I'll do my best. I wouldn't expect any less. Look, before you begin, I want to make something perfectly clear. Tell me I'm gonna As die. As an undercover operative for UC Sysdev, you'll be expected to follow our code of conduct and ethics. How would you know? Allow yourself to stray too far off the path, and you stand a good chance of spiraling out of control. What do you mean, stray too far off the path? The Crimson Fleet doesn't follow the rules. They only abide by one nah. thing. Money. The, uh, that undercover All dilemma. All morals and social graces fall by the wayside in pursuit of their greed. At first glance, this can appear quite enticing. So I'm warning you not to get lured into their trap. Think you can handle that? I think I can handle that. 
That's what I wanted to hear. Anyway, it's time to hand you over to Lieutenant Toft. She'll brief you about the details of the evidence gathering portion of the operation. Okay. Now, get, get out of here. All right. Good luck. Thank you. Good luck. How do I maintain contact with you? That's easy to answer. You don't. We'll be monitoring okay. your activities from the vigilance and attempting to keep it within your vicinity. When you feel you've gathered enough evidence and at the completion of your assignments, head back here for a debrief. Beyond that, you're completely on your own. Wow. All right. Good luck. Guess we gotta go do that then. Yep, you're, you're in the way there. Okay, we gotta go talk to Toft. Hey, Toft. Hey. All right. We don't have a lot of time, so I need you to listen up. While you're working undercover, it's imperative that you gather as much evidence as possible. If you find any records that look suspicious or incriminating, you bring it to me. Is that understood? Yeah. You want me to steal from thieves? Rationalize it however you like. But that evidence is critical to the success of Commander Akande's operation. I want data slates, computer downloads, handwritten notes. Hell, I'll take anything if it'll get those bastards thrown into the brig. You have a personal vendetta, maybe? Or like, maybe I touched a nerve. Mm -hmm. It's not you, it's the Crimson Fleet. That minor skirmish you had with them on Vectera was nothing compared to the death and destruction those pirates leave behind. If you've seen what I've seen, you'd understand why I'm pushing you so hard. I'll do what I can here. That's all we're asking. Oh, before you go, there's one more thing. Commander Akande has authorized a credit disbursement for each piece of evidence that you return as compensation for your efforts. Why are you paying credits during the military? That is actually the question I actually had in my head here. Well, that's just it. You're not career military, are you? And speaking frankly, you're completely out of pocket during this operation. Oh, no. You're paying for your own supplies and other unexpected incidentals. So if I were you, I'd stop asking questions and accept the compensation. Sure. Yeah. All right. Yeah. It's not generous. It's motivational. Commander Akande's idea. All right. We've loaded a container of Aurora into your ship's cargo hold. We're also providing you with a sample you can use to tease the goods. We've cleared your ship for launch. Proceed to Sidonia. Make contact with Sirsha Bowden. And with any Sirsha. Help, she'll point you to the Crimson Fleet. That should do it. You're dismissed. Yay! Okay. Um, no, I don't care about any of that. Know if you need anything else. Let's go. Pardon. Excuse me. Okay. Is everybody talking to me? Stop talking to me. You guys are very chatty for military people who are supposed to just be kind of doing your jobs. Howdy. Hey. No, shut up. All right. Wait, oh, that's the brig. Uh, I don't remember how I got here. Oh, docking port computer. What does this do? Oh. Uh, docking port one. Yay! Okay, so I got to go to docking port one. Excellent. Find docking port one. That says three. That says one. To be back on board. Okay. Now I've got to figure out this thing about checking inventory. It, it, can't, it can't possibly mean check the inventory like literally in here, can it? Is that just one of those activities that's just going to be stuck on my screen forever? Probably. Ooh, sandwich. All right, here we go. Um, we gotta get to Sidonia, right? Yeah. Is 
Cydonia. Is it here? Is it on Mars? No, it's not. Oh, right, 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 right. Okay, yeah, here we go. Um, Show on the map. Oh, it is. Okay. Oh, it's over on this side. Did that work? I want to see if I can get there normally. Ah, there we go. Yeah. Oh shit. No, no. No contraband. Okay, goody. Yay, okay. Oh, I don't want to. I want the Econo Hall. I want, I want that. Mars. This is very goofy how this is set up. Ah, uh, I wish, I, I wish there were a more, uh, fluid way of reaching targets. Oop, sandstorm. Let's get in here. You. All right, Sersha. If you're here to buy or sell, you might want to talk to Octai. I'm busy. Uh, I guess I should maybe ask about this. Hmm. Let's ask about Octai. We got Octai time. Octai and Bayar. He's the head of our Sidonia branch. If you want to do some trading, he's the one you need to be talking to. I'm busy. Gotta ask you a question, though. How is it that you have an Irish accent? Are you not Martian? Are you from Ireland? I mean, we can't really go to Ireland, can we? Earth is like some big generic ball. Uh, okay. Um, I'm looking to unload a sensitive shipment. And by sensitive, I'm guessing you mean something you don't want UC security sticking their noses into. I yeah. can probably help you with that. What have you got for me? Sample. Hmm. Aurora, huh? Nice. A little too hard to handle, though. What else you got? Uh -huh. The Trade Authority turning away contraband. Now I've seen everything. Do I want to butter her up here? Do I want to piss her off? <laughs> If you can't handle it, oh, what are you frowning at me for, lady? Oh, oh okay, we'll say you're, oh, you're right. yeah. yeah. What they didn't tell you is that I have a self-preservation streak a kilometer wide. Okay. Of course, if there's a finder's fee you're offering, I might, well, bend the rules a little bit. Uh. I just blow your brains out. Uh, can I give you the hundred thousand yeah, credits? Yeah. Suddenly, yeah. I do oh. remember someone who might be able to unload that stuff for you. Well, well. It appears she suddenly remembers everything. Hmm. How nice. There's a buddy of mine who runs with the Crimson Fleet. Goes by the name Adler Kemp. If he isn't passed out, you can find him killing the rest of his brain cells at the Broken Spear. Oh, and uh, it's been a pleasure doing business with you. Venus? Right. I guess we gotta go to the Broken Spear. Is that up that way? Oh no, that's that's to the outside, right? We have to go somewhere else. We gotta go to another planet. All right. I think I'm confused. Oh no, no, we're just going up here. Oh, this guy. Oh, this is the broken spear. Yeah, yeah, okay. 
Uh, somebody dropped their shirt. Oh no, that's... Ew, what is that? Some blanket? Towel? Leather coat? I don't know. Alright. Hey, guy. Ooh. That's a knife. And it's got blood in it. Uh, or, like, around the bottom of it, right? Ooh, yuck. Okay. Unless you're here to serve me another drink, you can turn around and walk away. No. Um... Yeah, sample. Here hey, we go. Why don't you say that a little louder? I didn't say anything! I think every single UC guard in Sedonia heard you! I showed it to you. Uh, okay. Okay. Yeah. I think we can help you with this. If you've got a whole shipment of this stuff, you're going to need to move it fast. But you're going to have to do something for us first. Um... Who's we and us? You're with... Oh, yeah. Let's just do it. Right yep. down to business! And no small talk. I like it. Well, this is utterly ridiculous. Do we really have to jump through these hoops to get what we need from you? <sighs> Lady, if you want me to move that shipment for your pal here, you're going to do whatever the hell I want. You got that? <laughs> you're now, ridiculously listen, German voiced. I'm not going to repeat myself. I need you to deal with a miner who's racked up a bunch of debt. Oh, not another one of those again. Either way, I want that money back. Um, how loud do you want this to be? What do I need to do here? Write you an instruction manual? Oh, it's a... You can do this loud. Okay. You can do this quiet. I don't care. I just want my goddamn money, and I want this guy to remember who he screwed over. All right, I get it done. Perfect. His name's Carl Fielding. I think you'll find him wandering around the Deimos Miners' quarters. Don't worry, you can't miss him. Just look for the most miserable-looking guy in the entire place. You don't sound like Dracula a little bit, maybe. Okay. Mm -hmm. Down this way. Right? No, maybe not. Hello, little guy. Nope. This is interesting. I've never been here before. Maybe I still won't be here. It's 15 feet away. 15 meters away. Down. Oh, down this way. Or maybe not. 25. Are we on the right level? Yes. Before you say anything, no. Mars is nothing like Earth. Heck, even Earth is nothing like what Earth used to be. Learning to accept the truth of higher power is key to understanding the universe. Okay. Oh, have I been here before? I am, I am so bad at remembering where things are. Stay safe. Yeah. Hey, buddy. Something I can help you with? I'm gonna beat you up. I'm here to collect the credits. Adler Kemp. Who the heck is that? Uh, I really don't have time to play these games! Got a deadline. What? Uh, play what games? You're obviously confusing me with someone else. You got the same accent, buddy. Look, I'm tired. It's been a long day in the mines. I just want to go home, wash off the dust, and relax. This has been fun. I'll go back and tell Adler you said that. Adler, uh, Adler, Adler. Oh, wait, you mean that Adler? Yeah, sorry. I thought you were talking about yeah. someone else. Uh -huh. <laughs> I told him I'd pay up next week when Deimos cuts our next profit share check. <laughs> I'll even bring it to him personally. Hmm? Sound good? Yeah? I don't think he's gonna like that. Uh, well, I mean, he doesn't really have a choice. Look, I haven't got a single credit to spare right now. Okay? 
He can't squeeze blood from a stone. You know? Right? Perhaps he's already been through enough. Oh, lady. Um... I'm tired of playing games, I guess? I know, why are you hurting so badly for credits? There we go. I'm a miner for Deimos. It's not what I was hoping for out of life. But here I am. Sad story. The Sad sack. Company. Pays me a salary. But I depend on the profit sharing bonuses to keep food on the table for my family. Adler thinks he spent all the money on boots. Hey, hey, hey. Now wait a second. Just because things are tough, and I might be spending my afternoons at the spear, it doesn't mean I don't care about my family. Adler doesn't get to judge me. No, he's just a low-life pirate who thinks he can push everyone around. Okay, I'm tired of playing games now. What games? Why are you doing this to me? I don't have the money. Uh... Worth the risk? Sure. I, I guess I, I could ask for a seven day shift. I don't know. There must be some way we can both win here. Maybe so. And Adler's gonna hurt you badly if you don't pay him back. Well, that's a tough one. Oh, that would be nice. Why the hell would I deplete oh. my savings? To pay off a stock like... Arthur we were Kent? having a good chance. Aww. I know, I know Adler is paying you to lean on me. So, you're just doing your job. But I swear, I've got nothing left. I feel like I misunderstood okay? how the persuasion system I works. I the last of my credits. My family starves. I can't afford to do that. I won't do that. Oh, God, I need to be a good guy. I'll pay the money. Holy crap. Really? You'd do that for me? Wow. Uh, I don't even know what to say. Thank you. For everything. And don't worry. I'll never borrow anything from Adler again. I promise. Okay, well, I guess we gotta go back to him. But we're gonna leave that till next time. And we're gonna be running our money low, aren't we? We're gonna be draining our funds. How much money do we have now? Oh, well, shit, I can afford that. Alright, so we'll be alright. Thanks for watching. See you next time.